Today I'm fishing the last three hours of the outgoing tide and then the first two hours of the incoming tide. There's a lot of wind out here right now, as you can tell, but I'll eventually end up in a creek and hopefully it'll be a lot more calm on the inside of the creek. I think we have a pretty good chance to catch some redfish and trout today. My plan for today is to look for fish out on this flat first. Not going to be very easy with the high winds. And then once it gets, the tide gets lower, I'll head into the creek. And I'll be fishing structure in the creek. I hooked the fish, accidentally turned the camera off. Been doing that a lot lately. It's a smaller size red. Didn't take too long. Hit the a gulp shrimp under a small popping cord. I gotta be careful because there's a lot of oysters out here right now under the water with how the level of the tide is. So I'm trying to get out of them while I'm fighting this fish. 18 and a half, not bad for a keeper size. Let's get some more. Need to hold it up for the camera. Yeah, it's probably 22 inches. Oh, this one's a lot smaller. Wow. <laughs> On the gulp shrimp again. This one's not even keeper size. I'm not even gonna measure it. Look at that. I mean, it's probably 14 inches or something. That's red number two of the day. I haven't been out here too long, so it's not bad. There it is. That's probably 14 inches or something. It's really small. Let it go. There it goes. A little trout. Got him on the gulp swimming mullet. This one's probably like 11 inches. There's fish here. I'll see them on the fish finder too. Yeah, that's a really small trout. Hopefully there's some bigger ones in here. Finally got another fish. I think this is a smaller red. Oh no, it might be a tr No, it's a red. Yep, a little red. Only the fourth fish of the day, but at least we found another area where they're at. Oh, he almost swallowed this too. Probably gonna end up keeping this. If it's a keeper, it's kind of small. Yeah, it's 16 inches kind of tore it up trying to get the hook out of it so probably wouldn't survive if I released it. I got my limit today. There's a hit. Got him right next to you. Oh that's a flounder. That's a surprise. Not a keeper. 15. This is probably like 12 inches or something. That's a pleasant surprise. Yeah. Got a little winter flounder. It's not a keeper, but I want to measure it anyways. The first flounder of the year. Yeah, it's 12 inches. A little 12 inch winter flounder. Alright, just gonna let it go. Oh, that's a fish. 
That was a fish. I got hit. There we go. Nice one, too. Put in a pretty good fight. I'm in a dried up hole that I had to get out of my kayak and walk to. Steve, I just got a nice red in this hole back here. Alright. It's a good size one. It's going to be the biggest fish of the day. Putting up a fight. Yeah. Yeah, that's a nice one. Probably over slot. Got the biggest fish of the day right now, fighting it. Yeah, that's a nice one. I got him on an electric chicken paddle tail on the eight ounce jig head. It's definitely over slot. Look at that fish, that's a good size one. Hooked them right in the corner of the mouth, so we'll have any problem releasing them to swim away. This is my fourth redfish of the day. Hopefully he doesn't swim away right now. Hold him up. That's a 25 or better. I'm gonna release him in the hole that he was swimming in. I know on my measuring board or else I'd probably measure him. All right, here's the next cast after just catching that fish. Let's see if I get another one. Right away. This one is a pretty good sized keeper. So that was the cast right after I just released that fish. That's a sign that there's probably a good amount of fish in this hole. It's a nice keeper. That's a pretty good one. Just reeled in slow. See something there you go look at that for his first cast and that's why I turned the camera on I had a feeling there's a lot of fish in there that's a smaller one yeah. smaller keeper size that's the thing about spots like this is of course they're gonna hit because where are they gonna go there we go that's a smaller one it's going straight in that's a big a nice trout wow biggest trout I caught in a while that's definitely a keeper you want it actually I'll probably keep it never mind <laughs> I might measure this one later. It's probably like 16 inches. Alright, let's see if we can get some more. Heavy. See what it is. No, it might just be a red. Yeah, it's a red. Smaller keeper size. Probably 16 inch red. Send it right back into the hole where it came from.
That's six fish in this hole so far. In like 10 minutes. <laughs> Did I go over you? Nope. Another one. This one. You know, it's another red. I keep thinking it's going to be a trout now after that one trout. Another one, probably the same size as the last one. All those, all these fish you've been seeing me catch is on a electric chicken paddle tail. Alright, seventh fish we've caught in this hole in like 15, 20 minutes. Well, probably less than that. There you go. That's a nice one. So that's like the eighth fish and 15 minutes worth of fishing. Same size as the last two that I caught, probably. Maybe a little bit bigger. All right, I think we should leave them biting. You ready to head back? You nuts. 